All right, village, welcome back. Part two, Thanksgiving 2022 cooking prep. I'm now going to make the cornbread for the dressing, only the cornbread. I did a dressing video, I believe, last year, but um, I don't remember. So this is the ingredients we have. Um, I have self-rising buttermilk, cornmeal. That's what we have. I have a, I'm going to use two cups of the buttermilk cornmeal. I'm going to use a cup of buttermilk. I'm going to, it's a um, half a cup of flour, two eggs. I'm going to put a half a cup of melted butter, a teaspoon of baking soda, right? We don't need the baking powder because it's self-rising. Are y'all ready for this homemade cornbread for our homemade dressing? All right, let's eat. All right, village, we are back. I have combined all my dry ingredients, the two cups of um, cornmeal, half a cup of flour, the um, half a teaspoon of baking soda. So guess what we have here? All combined. And this, I have the one cup of buttermilk and the two eggs. Get that whipped. Normally, and if I was just serving this as a side, like cornbread, I would put some sugar in it. But since this is the cornbread for my dressing, we will not put any sugar in it. You can put a little bit if you want to, but for mine, mm -mm, we don't like the sweet dressing. So that's that. I have the oven preheated to 375, and I'm going to make this in a hot skillet. So, we, um, let's get this combined. Not going to take long. I may have to add a little bit more. Oh, my butter. Half a cup of melted butter. Cool down. All right. Now we're good. Now we're cooking with gas. Yeah, I'm going to have to add a little bit more corn. A little bit more buttermilk. That was a cup. I don't want it that thick. Let's get some more buttermilk. Actually, actually, village, I'm going to add some evaporated milk. I'm not going to use any more of the buttermilk. Got the evaporated milk sitting right here good to go just so we can get it to the consistency that we want that is about a half a cup oh it's wasting everywhere all right then i'm gonna bring the skillet is heating along with the uh I put a tablespoon of oil in the skillet in the 375 degree preheated oven and let it get a hot. Because when you put that this cornbread in there to get those crunchy edges that we like, even though we're not going to use them because it's not the regular cornbread, but I still do that with the oil. So let me get the skillet. Look at that village. You see that? See that oil? We're going to take our batter. Skillet is hot. Put that all in there. That's how you get them crunchy edges. It's not too much oil. This is the cornbread for the uh, the dress. So it really don't have to be perfect. But I'm trust trust me, it's gonna be good coming out of here. Get all of that. Mm -hmm. All right, this is part two. Thanksgiving 2022. 
our meal prep, making the homemade cornbread for our homemade dressing. All right, we got that all incorporated. See how the edges went up? Because this is heated already. Hope you all can see that. I'm gonna put this in the oven, 375, 20 to 25 minutes. Gonna be nice golden brown, and we'll be coming back with the results. All right, village, shall return. All right, village, here is our completed corn homemade buttermilk cornbread for our homemade dressing for Thanksgiving. Thank you for tuning in to part two of our Thanksgiving meal, Thanksgiving cooking meal prep for 2022. Comment down below if you will be trying this recipe. I'm going to put it in the description. And do remember to keep on that notification bell because Auntie Bond is bringing these videos back to back to back to back. Thank you all for your support. Welcome to the new villagers. Until we eat again, God bless. Just, just wanted to let you all know as well, I've already pre-sliced, diced, and chopped my veggies that will be going in the dressing. These are my onions and bell peppers. I already did a video previously. I think on the celery, I did a short and I sliced and diced and that's already prepared, containered, and put in the freezer ready to go. If you can take the time to prep for Thanksgiving, your life will be so much easier and you can enjoy more time with family and friends. Also, Village, at the taping of this of this um, video, we are at 657 villagers strong. God bless.